Dun, da, da, da. The Olympics may be over, so now it's time to do the board game Olympics. Who is going to pull vault their way to the top and hopefully not have a fumble? So let's uh, get started, shall we? I've put everything into uh, bracket fights, so uh, afterwards you can do this yourself too and see how uh, yours goes. So let's start it up. Okay, Arkham Horror versus Feast for Odin. Uh, let's go over Feast for Odin. Brass versus Pandemic Legacy. Brass. Dune versus Star Wars Rebellion. Oh, definitely Star Wars Rebellion. Dune was way too long. Frosthaven versus Terraforming Mars. Oh, Terraforming Mars. Twilight Imperium versus Eclipse. Oh, these are two very giant space games. Um, I don't I've never played uh TI4, so I think I'm gonna go with Eclipse. Through the Ages and Brass. Well, I've only ever played Through the Ages on mobile, so definitely brass here. Ooh, oh, this one's hard. Arc Nova versus the Lost Ruins of Arnak. Oh. Arc Nova lasted in my collection a lot longer than Arnak, but I think if I think about what I want to play again next, I'm going to go with Lost Ruins of Arnak. Orleans versus War of the Ring. Orleans is definitely one of my favorite games. I love the bag builder aspect. Feast for Odin versus Brass. Oh, definitely Brass. Definitely Terraforming Mars. Definitely Brass again. This is going to come down to the two brasses. Oh, no, not this again. Orleans and Arnak. Oh, we're definitely going to go oh, the Orleans. Uh, okay, the original brass versus Terraforming Mars. Let's go with Terraforming Mars so it's not brass on brass. Because this is definitely going to be brass. Oh, Terraforming Mars versus brass. Brass. All right, who's coming up on the next leaderboard? Well, I have never even played Gloomhaven Jaws of Lion. I didn't even hear about it before today, so we're going to go with Spirit Island, although I do not like Spirit Island. It's going to lose. Nemesis versus Wingspan. I've never played Nemesis. I've played the system, though. I do like the system, so we're going to go with Wingspan. Terra Mystica versus Concordia. Ooh. Hmm. Well, I have Terra Nova, the baby Terra Mystica, because Terra Mystica was kind of too big. So I'm going to go with Concordia. Gloomhaven versus Castles of Burgundy. Castles of Burgundy all the way. Great Western Trail versus Scythe. Both good games, but more of a Great Western Trail fan than Scythe fan. Twilight Struggle versus Seven Winners Duel. This is hilarious that I randomly matched up both two-player only games. Uh, I'm going to go with Twilight Struggle because I've never played Duel. I've played all the other Seven Winners, but I like it. But in Twilight Struggle, I caused the end of the game by a nuclear explosion, which was funny. Gaia Project versus Too Many Bones. I've played Gaia Project more than Too Many Bones. But I would actually rather play Too Many Bones. Well, let's go with that. Root versus Clank. I've never played either of these. Root has way too many rules for me to try and figure out, so I'm going to go with Clank. Spirit Island versus Wingspan. Wingspan, 100%. Castles of Burgundy, 100%. That beats that out. Great Western Trail beats that out for sure. Too Many Bones beats that back out. Wingspan versus Castles of Burgundy. Castles of Burgundy for sure. Great Western Trail, yep. Ooh! Because I backed the new reprint and I sold my Great Western Trail, I'm gonna go with Castles of Burgundy. Da 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 da! The final matchup. <laughs> Both of these exist in my collection and have existed in my collection for so long. Well, not Castles of Burgundy, I have the old one. The new one's gonna come out. Oh! Mm. Dice chucking or. Rail line building, trains, and dice. Oh! I don't know. Who's going to reign supreme? I have... I've played Brass more times than Castles of Burgundy. Da-da-da-da! This is how it turned out. Let me know in the comments below what yours came out to be. Who pole vaulted to the top and uh, definitely no uh, mishaps with brass.